Good morning, everyone. It's 4.20 a.m. I wake up at 4. The train comes at 5.45 and I don't want to miss it. We're going to Berlin. My life's actually a mess right now, so we're packing like half an hour before I need to leave. Um, not ideal. I don't have any clothes. I literally didn't bring anything with me from Australia. So I'm just sitting out deciding what to wear. So painful. You guys have been talking about how beautiful the rest of Germany is. So I'm going to vlog my little visit to Berlin, let you guys know what I think. Also, it's a birthday present to me because it's my birthday. Haha. <laughs> I'm officially 21. Oh my god, it feels so weird. So we're packing now. This is my pile so far. Beautiful. I don't know why I'm bringing pants. It's going to be warm, but I'm going to stay overnight, so I don't know what the weather's going to be like. Germany is just as crazy as Melbourne sometimes, so. Sunrise is really pretty. Hold up, I want you guys to see it. I'm literally running late for my train right now. Anyways, um, hold up, I'm missing my shit. We're going to the train right now. Um, it's like five in the morning. My train comes in like six minutes, so I'm a little bit of a rush. I'm dressed like an absolute bum, but that is my lifestyle. I could have worn pants. Also, I left a lot of things out of my bag because I was like, I can't be bothered carrying it. So we'll see how I go with that. The way that I justified not taking some things, <laughs> probably some things that I needed to. Living the minimalist lifestyle. But yeah, I'm actually really excited. <laughs> I've honestly been so overwhelmed that I entirely forgot to vlog. So my train ride was good. Um, everyone was sleeping because it was so early in the morning. So I literally felt so bad like vlogging on the train. Um, and then I considered vlogging in the bathroom but then I was like that's probably not a good idea and it kind of smelt and then yeah I got off the train and I was so hungry yeah entirely forgot to vlog but I just went past the cathedral um and that whole area where like there's a bunch of buildings museums um artifacts yeah entirely baffles me how they built that when they built that they're so big so so big and um yeah it just entirely baffles me like they look old how the hell has something like that been built so long ago? Like, definitely blown away by the city. Um, and just that area in general was mind-blowing. Um, I have about an hour until the meet and greet, so I decided to try and visit Berlin Mall. Um, yeah. I have new, no idea where to go or what to do. I'm kind of just winging it. Oh, apparently I'm at this... I don't know, you guys would be able to tell me where I am better than I do. Yeah, I'm learning along the way that this is actually a gorgeous city and there's a lot to learn and there's a lot to see. Also just say the amount of people with iced coffee in their hand. So it turns out they do make iced coffee here, just not in Dortmund, but they definitely make it in Berlin. Every coffee store I've passed has made iced coffees and they don't just make like normal iced lattes. They make it where you've got like milk on the bottom and coffee like on the top and you've got, you've got that nice colour gradient in between. Yeah. As you can tell, I'm really passionate about the colour of coffee, so <laughs> definitely exciting to see pretty coffee now. Kind of random, but I look like a bum, so I went into H&M and bought some new shorts. Um, I also got this necklace, pretty cute. Um, so we're on our way to the meeting right now. Um, I just need to find an U-Bahn station. I have no idea where it is, but I'm going to look for one. Hopefully I can find it soon, because I need to be there in an hour. And I'm pretty sure it's like a 40 minute trip, so... I don't have too much time. Should be fine. I don't know. The city is beautiful though. Um, I just had a little look of the Berlin Mall. Very pretty. Um, I don't know. I feel like Chadston in Australia just set my standards so high for shopping malls. So I'm not as impressed by the ones that I've seen so far. But um, they're still nice. It's interesting how they try to impress everyone with like really big brands and names as soon as you walk in. Um, but yeah. It's really pretty, I really appreciate all the history around the city. So yeah, that's been nice. Okay, so 
so I tried to stay. The train is five minutes late, yeah, which is Entschuldigung. Ich habe eine Frage, I have a question. Um, die Eisbahn ist fünf Minuten spät, ne? Which is like, right? Yeah, genau, which means yeah, right? And then I was like, Gleis 4 instead of Gleis 4. <clears throat> Annoying, but like, I used the English word for instead of the German word for. So everyone, we are back home. Um, feels a bit weird to call this place home, but I guess it is. I've been here for like four months now, so technically this is where I come back to. It's kind of nice. But anyways, um, had an absolutely wild weekend. Not weekend, middle of the week. Felt like a weekend the way I was spending my day-to-day -day time. But um, I really enjoyed it and it was definitely worth every cent that I put into it. So yeah, I met her and then yeah, that was pretty much the whole night. Um, I had a bit of drama with my hostel um, that got sorted. And then, yeah, the day after, um, I got to explore the city a little bit on, you know, those like electronic scooters. Um, we took the Thier ones, Thier, I don't know. But I felt really bad for my friend because about like 20 minutes into the trip, she fell over. So the rest of my time before I caught my train was kind of just spent sitting at a cafe because she couldn't walk, but it was really nice. Um, just kind of sitting there, taking in the vibes. Yeah. The coffee shop was really nice. And yeah, just like relaxing a bit before coming back and getting back to things. Now, um, have a competition, world competition in October. So we're grinding towards that. Um, it's pretty big, it's a World Cup. Um, gonna be held in Copa, Slovenia. And it's essentially the first major international competition since COVID. So. It's huge and I'm going to be spending the next 14 weeks working on that and yeah I guess I'll update you guys on where I'm at in that journey. Um, yeah, thanks for watching, um, thanks for all the encouragement to go and view the rest of Germany, it was definitely worthwhile and I can't wait to show you guys my opinion and experiences on the rest of Germany. Thanks, bye!